to work today? I'll have to. But not yet. Good. <laughs> Are we going to change our names properly? Like, what's it called? Depot. I hadn't thought. Are you being called Eden? Not as much as I hate Sugden. Hello? It's Kate Tip. Is Andy there? Who is that? Kate. You didn't want to talk to her, did you? Of course not. May I join you? I won't be much company. Oh, so nothing's been sorted out then. Don't know if it ever will be. Andy wants nothing more to do with me. Oh, I'm sure it's not irredeemable uh, after all you've done for him. And Steph and I are always falling out, but we manage to call a truce, uh, however uneasy. Oh, he thinks I've ruined his life. He needs me, but I don't know. If he can't see that, I suppose I'd better stay away from him and. Hope he can figure things out for himself. How's that going to square up with working on the farm? Well, it isn't. I think I'm unemployed. Yep. Well, can I speak to Andy, please? Get lost! Daz, please, it's important. I'll take it. What for? Because she won't leave us alone otherwise. What do you want? Andy? Oh, thank God. I thought you were ignoring me. I'm trying to. Please, just hear me out. I know I haven't treated you right and I feel terrible. My heart bleeds. Oh, listen to me. I've made such a mess of things. Well, it's done now. We need to talk. But not on the phone, and I'm not going to stop calling until you see me. What's she saying? Andy? Um, I'll come round this afternoon. Thanks. You're not going to see her? She wants to sort things out. You can't take her back, Andy, not now. And I can't just ignore her. She's still my wife. <laughs> You mad? Don't forget to do the cows. I thought it was just me and you now. It is. So why are you running back to work? You're a kid. You don't understand these things. <sighs> Look, I won't be long. I'll come with you. No. You can't stop me from following you. Daz, please. I know what I'm doing, all right? Dad? Have you been up to the farm yet? Andy doesn't want me there anymore. We'll come round eventually. Wouldn't hold your breath. He's decided to call himself Hotwood and I'm back to plain old Jack. I'm sorry. No, I am. What I've done, I know it's unforgivable, but Katie and I really do care about each other. Yeah, I know you do. I don't want you to hate me. How can I hate you? I'm your dad. <laughs> Andy. I'm so glad to see you. Where's Robert? At work. You're looking well. Look, come on, let's go inside. I'm not stopping. You came. That's the important thing. Well, say something then. What do you want me to say? You're the one begging for us to talk. I don't know. I suppose I want you to forgive me. I know that that's silly and, and selfish. How could you possibly forgive me? 
I made such a mess of things. Yeah, you're right. I can't forgive you. Maybe I never will. But we all make mistakes. We all do things in life we know we'll get forever. Everything we had, that just suddenly can't mean nothing. Of course not. I'm not saying I'll have your back. You better understand that. It's just... I don't know, at least, I don't know, I... What are you saying? What? You think I've changed my mind? Why else am I here? Because I don't want you and Robert to hate each other. Robert? It's your brother, Andy. And then there's your dad and Victoria. They're your family and they care about you. This is about Robert? It's about all of us. I mean, because you want to talk about Robert? You bitch. Andy! Andy, please. Don't touch me! Sorry. Sorry? Sorry's your favourite word all of a sudden. If you're so sorry, then why don't you do the decent thing and just disappear? But where's the fun in that, eh? You rather hang around and twist the knife in. No. Oh, here come the waterworks. You're full of surprises. I loved you, Andy. You think that was all a lie? Why would I lie to you for three years? The people change, they move on! You didn't move very far, did you? Well, we can sort this out. We can all sit down and just... There is no we! Well, if you won't talk to Robert, then at least think of your dad and Victoria. They're your family and you can't turn your back on them. Stop telling me what I can and can't do. I don't want anything to do with you. All the somethings. I should use that gun when I had the chance. You don't mean that. You're doing it again. Telling me what I think. If you want to know what I think, I say you should tell that lover boy yours to pack his bags and do a runner while he can. Because the next time I see him, he's dead.